Orange Cassidy trying to will himself back into this match, but Shane Taylor, the heavy-handed power puncher from Cleveland, has been smothering Orange Cassidy, but Cassidy trying to employ his agility to get back into this one, Taz. This is, that's right, and that's the thing. Orange Cassidy's got to be innovative, use his quickness. And this, this works, this unorthodox offense. And Tony, we mentioned that this is the first time in Orange Cassidy's AEW career that he's not had the, the, the best friends. He's not had Trent Barretta, Chuck Taylor. Oh, look at Gogo -Go grabbing the boot of Orange Cassidy. He's got to fight through now three men because of it. He's all alone, like you said, Excalibur. Oh, Taylor, that hand gripped around the throat of Orange Cassidy. And now look at the strength of Taylor just carrying Orange Cassidy out. But Cassidy, those right hands. And now, desperation, right hands. Taylor with that grip on the throat finally releases. And Orange Cassidy coming in, looking for the DDT, but the wide base of Taylor once again coming into play. Stun Dog Millionaire! And now Cassidy. Oh! Oh! No! Oh. Into Lee Moriarty, who careens into our desk, and now the elbow on Anthony Agogo. Orange Cassidy trying to overcome the numbers here. He's rolling here. Here he goes. He's rolling. Here he goes. Orange punch, no. Taylor avoids. Orange Cassidy avoids a comebacker, though. You know, something we need to we One, two, and... Oh, that would, that would have been a really big upset, in my opinion. He almost got it, Shane Taylor. Something we didn't talk about, and we saw it right there. Shane Taylor's very quick as well, man. Oh, he is. And yeah. fans, this is breaking news. This Saturday at Collision, live in Peoria, Illinois, it will be the Elite versus Pac and FTR, a massive trios match as we draw closer and closer to Dynasty. Big matchup on 420 Saturday. As Orange Cassidy... Trying to, can he get up Shane Taylor for that beach break? No, oh, what a knee. Yeah, hell of an effort, but I'm not so sure. Oh, here it is. Oh, oh man. It, it didn't go down though. Yeah, this is a, a test of the chin of Shane Taylor. You gotta hurry up, Orange, you gotta hurry up. Oh, oh. Taylor drew him in with that. Shane Taylor's a man's man, guys. Oh, but, oh, oh. Taylor goes down. Oh, man, what a shot. One, two. Wait, Lee Moriarty immediately into the ring. And remember, Rocky Romero's not here. Katsuri Shibata's not here. There's no one to, to watch Orange Cassidy's back. None of his best friends are here. As I, think, I think Gogo's going to drill Orange Cassidy here. Oh, buddy shot. Oh, a left hook from Anthony Gogo. I'm telling you right now, Shane Taylor Promotions has become a force here in AEW, no doubt. As Anthony Gogo. Such power captured in that left hand, just unleashed on the midsection of Orange Cassidy. Yeah, that was some shot. And I, I think Shane Taylor wants more of a beat down here. And look, uh, Gogo and Moriarty now holding Orange Cassidy open. That's, that's okay. That's Christopher Daniels. Oh! Wait, who is that? Who is that? Matt Seidel and Christopher Daniels. Oh, who's, oh, Trent Barretta. Wow. Exactly. And Cassidy, I mean, he might be out of friends, but he's not out of men with, with a moral compass like, like Daniels and Seidel. They couldn't stand by and allow a beatdown like this to take place. And, but it seems like Trent has, has no compunctions of, about allowing Shane Taylor promotions to, to punish Orange Cassidy. This is absolutely oh, brutal. That, that, that didn't break his jaw. It really did. You could hear it crack. And now Moriarty, yeah. just insult to injury, that, that Border City stretches. And look at this, just walks away. The former best friend of Orange Cassidy. Back up. Trent Barretta. Yeah, this is brutal. A man we thought we knew in Trent Barretta just showing his true colors. And you wanna, you wanna talk about showing your true colors this past Saturday at Collision, Roderick Strong did exactly that to Kyle O'Reilly.